What we do here in Washington really matters, and that's why it's so exciting to work at a place like CAP. CAP is really unique. It's a place of ideas. The Center for American Progress has done incredible work to shape the debate over expanding opportunity for all Americans. The Center for American Progress is an independent, nonpartisan institute that works to improve the lives of Americans through progressive ideas and action. We explore the vital issues facing America and the world, develop bold, new policy ideas, and communicate those ideas to influence policymakers, thought leaders, and most importantly, the American public. CAP touches on everything, domestic policy to economic policy, energy, media, faith, LGBT, equality. We're always exploring new ideas and new technologies and how to combine the two. I think American Progress is different mainly because of the people that work here. So it's so diverse. We have somebody who's a Buddhist and I'm Muslim and then we have Jewish and all kinds of religions in our team. They're so accepting. I think we should all be so lucky to work at a place where your identities are celebrated, where your concerns are heard, where people are inspired for the same reasons that you are. You're really at a place that wants to make a difference in the world and not just, you know, make another headline. I grew up actually uh, poor and relied on a lot of government services from uh, food stamps to low-income housing and I saw that people making policy decisions, working to change laws to expand opportunity, had a huge impact on my life. Out of the 25 kids in my class that started out with me in ESL, in English as a Second Language, I was probably one of five that actually were able to access higher education. To me, that was sort of like a turning point. I knew that I wanted to do something about it. As someone who writes about LGBT issues but is also gay, I personally feel the, the stories that I'm writing about. And the work environment could not be described as anything other than warm and friendly and open. It's critical to have women's voices, people of color's voices, the LGBT community's voices, all of America's voices in the kind of work we're doing because I think that makes for better policy. Our work impacts communities in many ways. There are laws that are on the books today really because of CAP's leadership. When we see someone on the Sunday morning shows, it's amazing to be able to say that you're part of that. So I hope 10 years from now we'll look back and see that uh, the country is more free, more equitable, and more just because of the work we did.